So I'm sitting in the Harley Davidson F-150 and the truck right now is treating me like my ex. Now you're probably asking me, well, what do you mean it's treating you like your ex? Why would you say that your truck is treating you like our ex or like your ex? And I'm saying it's treating me like my ex because it's so good. Nest the God. What's happening, everybody? It's your boy Kendall Sean with the one and the only do 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 Blue Over Media. And uh, yeah, sometimes in life you gotta be a little bit dramatic. I know that joke was corny, hey, but whatever. This is how I am. Be you and don't let nobody else change your mind. On today, we're gonna talk about a couple of things. Um, I am in my uh, F-150 that a lot of you guys said I bought a lemon. <laughs> I'm in it right now and I wanted to give you an update on what happened with this. So after almost seven weeks of waiting, the parts finally came in. And so shout out to Roush. Uh, I don't know if anybody from Roush will ever watch this video, but shout out to Roush for making sure that your part of it was taken care of and you know, the compressor and all that came in. So for you all that did not know, man, I've had that when I first bought the truck, I had it for just like a couple of weeks and right before Bleed Ford Blue Fest, the AC went out. And you all, it has been hot as heck out here in the Illinois area. And it's been hard for me to drive this thing. I literally have to drive my wife's car or drive this at night, or I always have to have the windows down. But now the AC is, is blowing cold. I don't know if, know if you can hear it through here, but the AC is blowing cold. And so, man, uh, it, it got fixed. And man, when it got fixed and I got it from back from the dealership, uh, it, it did me well. So let me just, I don't know if I can necessarily show you that it's blowing cold, but hey, look. You can, uh, you can kind of hear. <laughs> and I'm sitting in here with the actual windows up. Oh yes, the windows are up and everything is blowing cold. And so, you know, I'm, I'm very appreciative of that. And as you can see here, I, I just had it at 70 and it's cold it can actually go 10 degrees lower than that but i actually had it at 70 and it's blowing cold so i'm really really excited about that but with that um after doing that so i told you all my uh, the other issue that i had was that the transmission would do this funny shifting well now it kind of went back to that and from my understanding i believe it's because whatever they did at the dealership now has this car relearning everything and because of all this custom stuff uh, this is the issue so I'm gonna let this trans, like I'm gonna go through drive it for you know, a few weeks or whatever so that it can relearn everything because it was working fine until I took it back. But I guess when they plug the computer up, it has to relearn stuff, whatever. I'm gonna wait and then go from there. But no, I don't have a limit. It's just the technical stuff when you add on all this extra stuff, but it's actually running good uh, right now. They look, I could get past the train as long as this AC is working, but I need this thing to be ready for Mustang week as well because I'm going to be taking this to pull that car on the Mustang week. And so, yeah, I'm, I'm excited about that, but let's come off of this. I kind of told you all the updates with the F-150. We're going to be putting this on the dyno. One of the future videos in the next couple of weeks you're going to see is that we're going to actually put this supercharged Roush F-150 Coyote Harley Davidson F-150 on the dyno and we're going to see the numbers that it runs. So stay tuned for that. All right, so this is kind of like a interlude, but I don't know even what video I'm gonna put this in, but I went to go check my mail and I had a package here from a very famous YouTuber. That's right. I got this package right here. Now, a part of me thinks I know what it is, but I wasn't told that a package was coming. And so I want to do the reveal with you all um right here um yeah let's see what's in here I'm trying to see if i can hold the camera and do this at the same time like this is not a part of the video i just said let me pull the camera out and just record this and let me open it with you all oh oh, 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 oh. oh man when i tell you this guy is unreal 
You all don't even know, but this is, wow. Wow. Michael Johnson, you are something else. 417 Fox, you are something else. You are something else. All right, so just in case you all don't know, <laughs> this piece is the carbon fiber piece um that he uh um, he gave me before for the radio bezel which i have the winner for the person that i'm giving my one that i bought from but this is for the shifter as well let me tell you how this works so much at this point i forgot all about this i forgot that he was even doing this this works so well because this just gets me even more prepared for mustang week i actually wasn't pleased with my uh shifter bezel i feel like i had a couple marks that i didn't like and man this is right on time dude 417 fox you are the man shout out shout out to you dude like you all make sure you go and man i'm pretty sure he's about to have these available make sure you all go to his page and check them out all right so i'll give you all the install on it and everything stay tuned so here's uh well my favorite notch back in the world <laughs> i guess my own of course the door is locked well today what we're going to do is you all know that i'm getting this thing prepared uh for mustang week and you heard me talk about the present uh, that I got from 417 Fox that I have sitting right here. I'm going to show you all uh, what needs to happen with this when you put it in. And so for me, what needs to happen first is that because this so the one that he gave me before, which works amazingly, it sits on top of this piece. It's a little dark in here, but it sits on top of that. So when I have to pull this out in order to get this piece back off and then i'm going to put this one on and then show you exactly uh what that is going to look like now understand this i'm a big fan of the carbon fiber look and if i could do a lot of this stuff carbon fiber i wouldn't want to do the whole thing but i like the accent of carbon fiber that is within this and so once again the thing that 417 fox is doing he's revolutionizing and, and changing the fox body game as it relates to getting this stuff done and so i'm gonna go ahead I don't need to necessarily give you instructions, but I do want to tell you one thing uh, about this piece. So the piece is like the one that comes from LMR. The only thing that you have to do is put these little clips on. These clips will be inside of a bag. You have to put those on. And that's really it. Nothing, nothing too hard or anything like that. You just put those on and then go from there. But like I said, if you can see in the light, it's the, the, the wrap is just gorgeous. And so I'm going to go ahead get that piece taken out put this one in and then show you all what that looks like so stay tuned all right let's just take a look at the brand new install carbon fiber piece and there it is you all there it is completely in let this thing focus a little bit as you all saw before i already had this one from 417 fox and now that is in there like I said, had to didn't want to necessarily do a whole install video on it. Cause I mean, you all kind of know how to do this. And if not, it's, I believe it's the LMR one on it, but I mean, it looks good. I probably could have uh, brought my controls up just a little bit more, which is fine, but I'll deal with it the way that it is. But I, uh, I just love um, the way that all of this looks now. I mean, from the Holly screen here, all the way down to this like this just looks um amazing like i am very very pleased with for lack of better words the aesthetics of the inside and yeah this this looks great to me so one of the things i was not trying to do anymore i'm really trying to stop beating myself up uh for what's not right about the car um i keep seeing that's what happens when you have Bluetooth playing. Um, I keep finding stuff uh, that, you know, as I'm trying to get prepared for Mustang week, I keep just finding little stuff here and there. And I know that I'm in the convention center and I know it's a lot of other nice cars and all that, but you know what? I just have to make up in my mind. Your car is nice. The little thing that you see under the dash right here in this one little spot, nobody's gonna notice, but even if they notice, who cares at this point? let me just go ahead and, and just get this thing together and just be grateful for where it's at and what i'm able to accomplish um, i'm about to put the wheel woods on it one of the next videos you're going to see is with the brakes on it with the wheel wood brakes on it so super excited about that but yeah like 
I am very, very happy with what I see here. Let me just show you one last time. Yeah, this is Mustang week ready. For me, it is. Just a couple other things I gotta do. I gotta get some other mats, hide those wires hanging right there. I just actually just did that. But I gotta get some other mats uh, for the car to get ready for Mustang week. But for the most part, the interior is ready to go. Um, everything interior wise looks fine. But like I said, I have to do something with that with that mat. That mat just looks terrible. But the radio is in there. It's tight. It's looking good. And yeah, everything else looks great. So I am thoroughly pleased with everything. And look, I haven't driven the car uh, since that day um, that we won that event. I pretty much it's pretty much has been in the garage. And even though the paint looks great, it's actually very dusty. And I've been a little nervous to uh, do anything with it. But it's actually kind of dusty right now. But like I said, I'm just trying to, you know, get it ready for Mustang Week and not do too much. So bottom line, shout out to my man, Michael Johnson, 417 Fox, for what he did and putting this thing together for me. Like, it was a, a big surprise. Um, and I'm, I'm just forever grateful for I'm just forever grateful for people just uh, being a blessing. And like, I like to be a blessing to uh, others as well. And so um, also the winner of the one that I had, um, I am putting your name in the comments. I will be tagging you and sending you an email as well. The winner of the other piece that I already had, I will be tagging you and putting your name in the comments. And so make sure you go to blueovermedia.com to get your official bleed for a blue shirt. They are available right now. I'm only have a little bit more left and then I'm out and then I'm going to hoodies uh, because that season is coming up on us. But yeah, that truck will be towing this car to Mustang week and man, we're gonna have a good old time. So. Do me a favor, if you like this video, make sure you like, make sure you subscribe. Breaks are coming up. Next video, it's your boy Ken Sean, Blue Over Media, and I am out.